your cookie coach. And back with me this week is my son Hayden. Hello. It is the cookie rookie. This week we did cookies for President's Day. We did a teddy bear design for Theodore Roosevelt. A top hat design for Abraham Lincoln. And then we did cherries for George Washington. Okay, let's go get started. Okay, we're gonna start with the teddy bear cookie. First, we're outlining his head with a number three decorating tip. And then the ears and the muzzle. As you can see, we're doing a brown color and we're moving right on to his belly. And then we're gonna outline his body, just following the natural outlined edge of the cookie. And then we're gonna move right into his paws. And then the inner ear. Next we're moving on to the flooding of the head with the brown icing and moving it around with a toothpick. Now the film is sped up to um, about double the speed, so you know, go as slow as you need to go, whatever is most comfortable for you. Take your time, get comfortable with the uh, the equipment and the icing. And just take your toothpick and move around that icing, getting in all those little nooks and crannies, especially down there by his feet. There were some little sharp edges. And then we're going to outline his ear with just a little bit of icing because there's not a lot of space for it to go. And then just poke it down with the toothpick. Fill in any air gaps. And we're filling in his ear and his muzzle. Now the flood icing, it's gonna take about overnight to dry to a surface that you can um, write on with a food writer if you decide to work with a food writer. So just keep that in mind. So flood your cookies like at the end of the night so you don't have to wait a long time during the day. And then just come back the next day and um, put in your detail work. And for the detail work, we're gonna put in his mouth with black icing with a number two tip his nose, and his eyes. And then we're gonna add a little red ribbon with a number two tip. And you're done. Here's Hayden with his cookie. Apologize for any lighting. We're trying to experiment with different surfaces to decorate on. But you can notice there was a brown smudge on his cookie. That's where he started and it, it just didn't, he got too much icing on it. So we tried to wipe it off and start over. Now Hayden did struggle quite a bit with this cookie um, and the cherry that you'll see upcoming. Um, we figured that it is because he was standing up to decorate as was I. But I have a little more decorating experience than he does. And um, in episode one with the Valentine's hearts, uh, we were both sitting down to decorate. Um, so do what is most comfortable for you. If you are comfortable sitting down, you can do that. If you are comfortable standing up, do that. You don't want to make this a burden. <laughs> Just make it nice and comfortable. And you can see he's, right now he's flooding. And 
moving in the icing with the toothpick. He's going to flood in the body with the brown icing and then move it around with a toothpick. Looks like he just needs a little bit more icing. Then he's going to smooth down his area. Hayden opted out of making the muzzle, as you can see, and um, just went with a straight brown teddy bear. He's moving around the flood icing with a toothpick, getting in all the little nooks and crannies. And I apologize for the camera angle as well. Um, just trying to figure out what works best. And now we're filling in his ears. And again, taking the little toothpick and filling in those little bubble areas. Getting it right up to the outline edging. And Hayden is gonna use a food writer on his. And he went with a very unique design in honor of former president, Theodore Roosevelt. He is going for a Theodore Roosevelt teddy bear cookie. Very creative. Okay, we're moving on to the cherry. We're outlining with a number three decorating tip in red. And then we're going to add a stem. I think I used a number five tip with green. We're flooding the area again with red flood icing. And we're going to move that around with a toothpick and fill in all those gaps. Now cherries are in honor of President George Washington may or may not be a myth <laughs> about chopping down that cherry tree when he was a young boy and now i'm adding the leaf with a leaf tip in the green icing we're all done hayden's gonna work on his cherry cookie now now again he was standing up so his Pressure in his decorating bag is a little off. And you'll notice sometimes the icing just wants to come out too fast or too slow. You just have to learn um, by doing what is going to work best. You might need to apply more pressure or move your hand quicker or slower. Just, just practice. Lots of practice. He's adding his stem and a makeshift leaf. And then we're going to add in the, the flood icing again and move around with a toothpick to fill in all the gaps. Just practice, practice, practice. And then his leaf. And now Abraham Lincoln's stovepipe hat. Not quite as tall as a stovepipe hat, but I had to create the cookie by cutting it off a different shape cookie cutter. And we added the hat and the brim and it has a band on the hat. Probably a morning band. <laughs> For all you history buffs out there. On the top of the hat with the flooding icing. Move around with a toothpick. 
and inside the band. So if you enjoyed this video and would like to see more, please subscribe to the channel, give the video a thumbs up, and give us a comment. You can find us on Facebook and Instagram in, in the description below. All right, we'll see you next week. Bye.